Hello. Yes, please come in. My name is Kenshin. I'll be your dentist today. So how can I help you? Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, so you're not feeling too well and you think you have a toothache? Mm -hmm. Okay, before we get started, I need to ask you a couple of questions, if that's okay. Okay? Alright, so my first question is, for how long have you been experiencing this pain, this problem? In a few hours. Okay. And during these few hours, has it gradually been getting worse? Or? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so let's get you checked out. So what I'm going to do is just a little bit of a dental checkup just to find the exact problem and eradicate it in the most non-painful way. In a way such as not causing you so much distress. Okay, so the first step of this process is just to gather a quick information about you. Okay. Okay, can you tell me your names? Okay, and your age? Mm-hmm. Okay, I understand. And is there any previous medical history of any teeth problem? No? Okay. And have you ever had any wisdom teeth problem? Mm -hmm. This is very crucial. Okay, I understand. And what about your uh, tooth care? What about your uh, oral hygiene? Do you do basic cleaning? Because this is one of the uh, one of the most important parts when taking care of your teeth. Mm -hmm. How many times a day you brush your teeth? Okay, fair enough. We'll see if you brush them properly because improper brushing causes abrasion which uh, uh, destroys the enamel of the teeth which makes it more vulnerable to such problems like cavities or any bacteria that could cause you uh, some problems, some pain. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's going to be all for the questions, so let's get started. I brought some gloves, uh, you're not allergic to latex, right? Okay, I'll note that down. It's important that you're not allergic to latex. There's no need to worry. Uh, if there's any problem, I'm sure we can quickly solve it in the most uh, in such a way that, uh, like I said, won't cause you so much pain. Okay, so okay now, I'm going to inspect your teeth and your mouth just to look for the problem that is causing you so much pain right now. Okay, just relax. Okay, I'm just using my tools just to just using this magnifying
class that will allow me to have a closer look, a nice close look of your teeth. I have to say your teeth looks so protected. I'm pretty sure that your problem is nothing serious that would would make my work difficult to do. Mm. Okay, let's see here. The scissors look good. What about the canines? Molars, molars. Oops, there's. Yes, I see the problem. One of the canines. Yep. The lower jaw. Okay. So there's a little bit of a cavity that needs to be uh, taken care of. So we need to uh, act. Uh, really fast, so the problem doesn't get any bigger, okay? So the situation doesn't get any worse. I just... Uh, just touch. there's any discomfort, please raise your hand and I'll stop, okay? Alright. Does that hurt at all? I know it's uh, difficult to talk with an uh, open mouth, so I'll just try to understand you as much as possible. Uh, so that's why I ask you to use your hand if there is something you want to tell me, okay? Okay, now we're going to start with uh, taking care of that cavity. Yes, now you can close your mouth for a few seconds so you can rest. Now it's uh, tiring to hold your mouth open for quite a while. Or for some people it is. Okay, now I'm gonna put this around your mouth. Just open your mouth really wide for me. Yes, thank you very much. Okay. Just relax. I know this process is very delicate. There is no time to relax, but we have to take care of that as soon as possible. Time is on the essence. Okay, just need to work a little bit here. Then after that, I'm going to check the rest of your teeth just to look for any other problems that might alarm me and draw my attention. Have you recently eaten any hard food such as any nuts? or any really hard sweets or something like that, even jawbreakers. No? Well, I recommend avoiding eating such hard food because this is excessive pressure to your teeth which causes them to wait, wait, let me just this causes them to weaken their strength. They 
human teeth are made to mechanically break down the food so this is easier for you to swallow it and digest it there are four types of teeth in your mouth the incisors, canines, premolars and molars each one has specific functions one of them has the function to uh, tear down the food the others have the function to crush down the food and then after that next step is swallowing the food and digesting it okay. and just get up close to you here just need more from this side it's easier for me now one of the most important parts of the tooth body is the enamel it is like I said the most important highly mineralized substance on the teeth which plays a key role in striking your teeth the more mineralized the enamel is the more strength the teeth has when facing such problems like cavities or any bacteria that could land on the teeth. Okay, I'm just trying to explain you uh, some things, some facts about the human teeth. Human teeth are something fascinating. And the human teeth are only once in a lifetime. Believe me, this uh, I've had so many patients that they made me realize something. That is, taking care of your teeth is one of the most one of the most important things in life. Because you have them once in a lifetime. You have those temporary teeth. And after that, the permanent ones grow up. And after them, there's nothing left to grow. These are the last teeth that are left for us. Help us swallow and just the food we need to consume in order to survive okay now open your no, wait just close your mind for a bit let's just take a few seconds rest uh, we're halfway done just need to we're almost uh, done with this cavity problem okay now we can open your yeah, just open, just gonna quickly check your tonsils. Okay. Okay, very good. Let me just... And if there is no mineralized substance on the tooth, then the enamel may fail to form, which causes the dentin to expose on the surface. Uh, these two, the enamel and dentin, are one of the four major tissues that makes up the tooth. Like I said, two of them are the enamel, dentin, cementum, and the dental pulp. Okay, I'm not gonna jump to details about them just want to maybe you have studied about them I'm not sure but like I said you might get bored 
me just working, so I'm just trying to talk. You can multitask here and work on your teeth. It is really important for us not to neglect taking care of our teeth by uh, basically just cleaning them with toothbrush, maybe even mouthwash if you want, or those uh, ropes they use to clean their teeth where there's something stuck between them. I have this problem when I'm eating popcorn and then there's something like a popcorn residue stuck between my teeth and uh, you are use toothpick or those ropes that clean the residues that are stuck between your teeth. So far is there any discomfort? I didn't notice that you were raising your hand. So it's all good? Perfect. Let's see. On this side here. So when taking care of your teeth, the most basic thing to do is just proper cleaning with a toothbrush, mouthwash, and floor right paste. Do not access the use of fluoride paste because excessive use of this paste may cause abrasion of your teeth which causes the enamel to fail to form. Like I said the dentin starts to exposed on the surface of the tooth, of the teeth. Okay. Let's just rest a little bit more. Now I'm gonna put another into this side here. Yep, just open the mouth wide for me. That's it, perfect. Okay. Let me just get my magnifying glass and just finish what we've started. So you're feeling the pain is easing up? Okay. You're raising your head. Is there any problem? You're feeling kind of a discomfort. Okay. Alright. Okay. Let's stop for a bit. Let me just put my tools away. Just open your mouth wide for me. I'm just gonna have a, a closer look of what is causing you this pain. Okay. Okay. When this kind of problem comes up, using anesthetic measures such as uh, pain relievers, what I'm going to do now is just going to inject this syringe to your mouth so the pain relieves, and this may help me to solve your cavity problem easier. Okay, you just hold still and relax. There's any pain, just raise your hand and I'll stop. Okay. Now, like I said, open your mouth wide open. Thank you very much. Okay. Yep, just like that. Stage measurements. Just to ease up the pain with this plain reliever. Okay, there we go. It's not a fully pain reliever. It's just uh, for you not to feel any pain when I'm working with your teeth. Okay. So there's one more thing that could expose the 
the tooth and that is the excessive amount of the chemicals that are used in the toothpaste so tell me uh, do you use many toothpaste products and you change them often to see if there are any differences I totally understand so what I recommend is that to use toothpaste that contain natural products because it is much more better for your teeth and the enamel of your teeth which like I said is plays a key role when protecting your teeth from any unwanted problems like I said such as cavities or bacteria or any other problems similar to these We're almost done. Okay. Yep. All right. I think we solved the problem and we eradicated this cavity problem. So, yeah. Just take these off and uh, in here. Okay. Okay. Now the most, uh, the hardest part is done. So just going to have a look of your other teeth. Okay. Now this teeth is. All well now. Okay. Once again, just gonna check your tonsils. Okay. Very good. All right. Here on the upper jaw. Okay. Yep, your teeth are brilliant. I have never seen such a such a strong and uh, clean teeth you have a teeth cleaning routine or something like that uh, just a basic cleaning yeah I'm not seeing any abrasions so I guess there are no such things as proper cleaning in your case Uh, do you use any specific mouthwashes? Okay, yes, that counts. That's very good. And what about your wisdom teeth? Have you ever had your, any problems with them? No, that's very good. Okay. And check. If just to have a closer look if there are any more problems that I may find. Okay. That's it. I'll just relax. Let's see here. No, not at all. Had a deeper look and not noticing anything else. So I guess we're all good now. Yes, you can close your mouth now. You, you deserve a rest. Let's put these gloves on. Okay. Personal information gathered. Teeth and mouth exam done. Cavity treatment done. And last but not least, the conclusion. I haven't got much to conclude. Apart from that, your teeth are in perfect condition. And you seem to have a really good teeth cleaning routine. I don't know why I had this cavity problem. I guess you ate something hard, for example, nuts. Mm -hmm. Well, what a 
recommend is avoid eating hard food and focus more on the tender one because it really matters when you put pressure on your teeth. The less pressure, the better. That's all. No worries, you're most welcome. After all, my task is to eradicate any teeth problem that I may find during the examinations of my patients. So that's going to be all for this examination. Thank you for being such a great patient. Feel free to come anytime you want when you're concerned or when you have problems with your teeth. And I hope you have a great day.